In one of my previous videos, I checked out, what was it called again? Wondershare. No, what was it called? Oh, Movavi. One of the last videos I made, I checked out Movavi and if it's actually good still in 2021 to edit your videos with. And I proceed to shit all over it. Uh, but in that, in the intro of that video, I mentioned free software like Resolve and VSDC and how if you hate yourself, you use VSDC and else there's just no reason why you use VSDC because it actually sucks. One day I'm going to have to check out it, check it out and uh, make a video about VSDC. <laughs> but one of the other softwares I forgot to mention was Lightworks. Not too long ago someone asked me hey why is my software crashing so much i'm using lightworks and my computer is really good um and that made me think hey i have not i've not used lightworks since 2014 2015 i wonder how it's now you know let's check it out you know let's edit something in it and that something is going to be this exact intro that you're watching right now let's get into it all right so first thing we notice when opening a new project, it is telling us to, wow, give it a title. Well, let's call it Lightworks Intro. Let's go to Advanced and there is nothing we can do because we don't have a license. Great. Oh God, I am so overwhelmed just by looking at this. All right, let's make that like that, first of all. Then let's put that to the side. Let's move this over so we can probably see. Somehow we're going to, going to need to import the files, which I have right here. Drag it into here. Oh, cool. So, the, oh, so this is the bin. Oh, okay, gotcha. All right, let's just put that in. All right. Cool, 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 cool. That's fine. I don't need that. Video is also rolling. All right, and then I have this other file. This is just OBS recording my capture card. I would need another, can I? Um, sequence commands maybe? Tracks, add a video, cool, all right. Um, is there like different mouse tools? Because right now I'm just in like the moving one. First of all, can I cut by just dragging? No. Okay, I have different a way to select different tools? No. I just want to cut some stuff up, <laughs> to be honest. Oh god, what did I do? Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Can I disable video one? Oh, I can. This is awesome. Um. Okay, that's... Okay. Let's line this up like that. Okay, cool. Right. And now I disable audio one, and now it should be synced. So if I start playing, video is also rolling. Three, two, one. Awesome. All right, now I just need to find a way to cut like right here. Now make sure that your cap locks is off. Otherwise this won't work. So with your marker at point where you Wait, make sure your what? Now make sure that your cut blocks is off. Your cut blocks is off. What does that mean? I have to cut and trim a video fast tutorial. Let's go. Yeah, please. Tab where I've added a video clip, cutting cool. it out. Yes. Clip. Okay. Add to where you want to well, and press the C key on your keyboard to make the cut. Wait, is it because this is not enabled? Like, do I need to? It's not cutting. Control key while dragging your clip. Oh, can I? Can I? No, I can't. Why can I not? <gasps> I can. Okay, so it's, I just need to hold control, I think. So if I now um, disable this, I want to disable this. And then video is also rolling. Awesome. Three, two, one. Ah, that, lo that looks, that looks synced enough. All right, let's hope this is not as sharp. Yeah, context. The first take I did, I found it way true. This looks okay. Mhm, mm mhm, mm mhm. Mm Very professional, Jay. You gonna you gonna start talking soon? Last. <laughs> <laughs> One of my previous videos, I checked out. What was it called again? I want to leave that in. So, this I want this to be the start, right here. Hey guys, and welcome back to Lightworks Tutorials. And all you have to do is hit the delete button on the keyboard that's it as you can see it's deleted 
Why did they change that to C? Why is everyone saying C? C doesn't f work. Now let now we can actually like start the editing. All right. So boom, boom. Oh, that doesn't. Okay. Well, can I shift delete? Can I control delete? Can I shift backspace? Can I backspace? All right. We just we're just gonna have to do this. One of my previous videos, I checked out. What was it called again? That that's funny. All right. That's funny. What was it called again? All right. And then then we're gonna cut right after that. Cool. 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 All right, boom, and I want to zoom in here. All right, I want to zoom in on this clip. How do how do we zoom in? Drag the 2D DVE effect onto the section you marked to add it. So basically, I need to go to DVE. It's called this. All right, I want to apply the effect. Then I'm guessing I need to go here. Right. All right, and then I just want to scale it up. Let's say I want to scale it up by 25%. Cool. Let's go back to edit, and so this is how it looks like now. These videos I checked out. What was it called again? Wondershare. Yeah. All right. 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 Boys, we're editing. We're editing. All right. Oh, that is laggy though. To like, like drag it. That is really laggy. Sure. Let's do. Let's do it right there. What was it called again? Wondershare. All right. And then we cut there again. So remember, if you're ever use Lightworks, it's not C to cut, it's delete for some fucking reason. I don't know. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay, okay. That's actually kind of funny. It's kind of funny. I forgot I did that. Um, thought I was in the first take that I did this. So we're going to delete that, delete that. We're going to put this there. I'm going to put this there. Oh, Movavi. <laughs> there we go. There we go. There we go. Boom. All right, and then go back. Let's go. One of my previous videos, I checked out. What was it called again? Wondershare. No. What was it called? Oh, Movavi. Whoa! What was that? Share. No. What was it called? Oh, Movavi. Why is it black? Oh, Movavi. Huh. All right. I think that it's not using my GPU to accelerate the system, like the rendering, but my CPU starts spiking. So I don't think it's using any of my G So playback, okay, it's not smooth, but that might be because, you know, not paying for it, it's free software, what can you expect? It's not like Resolve is completely smooth without any problem and uses your GPU to accelerate. Nah, there's no other software that does that. What are you talking about? That should be smooth. All right. Last thing to do was just basically edit the entire thing. It was zooming in, cutting at the right moments, adding some background music, and there we go, we're done. Let's, I guess the last thing to do is to render it out. And this is, I, I know that there's a sweet sequence command, export mp4, right? And this is what I find. Notice how it is limited to 720p. That is quite sad. I'm going to just to test it out, whole sequence name, we'll call it, you know, Lightworks intro. Yeah, notice how it's using a lot of my CPU, but barely any of my GPU, like it's using one to 7%. Or is it called Lightworks intro? In one of my previous videos, I checked out. What was it called again? Wondershare. No. What was it called? Oh, Movavi. One of the last videos I made, I checked out Movavi, and if it's actually good, still in. I mean, yeah, that's 720 beam. If I make it smaller, 21 to edit your videos with, like, and I proceed to shit that's over small. it. That's uh, But in that, it will in look the intro good. Of that video. I mentioned free software like Resolve and VSDC. I can see a lot of artifacting over in, in this wall though, which is supposed to be a gradient because of the light. Uh, it's 720p, I shouldn't expect. I just wish it was at least 1080. 1080 would have been nice, all right? I get that you don't want to do 4K, but it's 2021. Make 1080p, like add it to the free plan, please. <laughs> also, I paid for plugins. Let me use them, please. I didn't want to use them this time, but let's say I did. Let's say I wanted to see the performance in Lightworks compared to what it would be in Fusion or After Effects. Look at the plugin performance. Couldn't do that even if I wanted to. So uh, uh, that was it for this. Let's do an outro. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Let's, let's talk some things over. I already 
did some, you know, talked about what I liked and, well, I didn't like anything. I told, I talked about what I disliked. Um, I would say it's better than Movavi. It's smoother. It does do B-Raw, apparently. Um, so I might have been able to use the cinema camera, but you know, another time. There were some weird things. It wasn't as smooth, but it was smoother than Movavi, which is a good thing. The only thing that's stopping me from recommending it is the export settings. Allow, please allow us to, you know, even in the free version to export to 1080p or another file format, you know, 1080p, for example, a 1080p MOV. Why not? You know, the transforming stuff should all be already be in the clips. There's a few things I would just change in the edit tab. I didn't, di I didn't hate editing in it. I didn't come into as much as a frustrations as I did with Movavi and Movavi is paid. <laughs> I can tell that there are limitations here more than there are in Movavi though, but I also know that they are gone once you pay for the software. Anyway, um, next software I'm checking out might be Avid Composer Media One something. Anyway, Avid has a Avid Media Composer has a free version uh, similar to how Lightworks handles it, and uh, I want to check it out. And that might be next video. See you guys.